Hi guys, welcome to Rapturous House. My name is Tanya. I hope you all are doing absolutely wonderful. Let's see what's the energy coming towards our Virgos today, okay? I do want to thank you all. I want to thank you all for all your likes, all your shares, all your subscribes. They're all so, so, so greatly appreciated. If you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, please do so. That way you'll get notified anytime I upload any new video footages, okay? If you would like a personal reading, my website's information is down in the description the description below along with everything you need to know about me okay i do call on the holy spirit i call on the white light that guides us i call on the goddesses that gives us our strength and the angels that protect us show me what it is that i need to see show me what's the energy coming towards my virgos today what's the energy i do love you all protection mm. extremes action spirit feels like they need to protect you from your own self oh yeah that's the energy that's coming towards you guys today spirit feels that feels the need to protect you from yourself to protect your peace you're growing out of a situation that you're still entertaining in some type of way shape or form it could be in any aspect of your life but i do see that spirit is here protecting you okay there is a strong need for some apparent reason because for somebody here you're overindulging. for somebody here you're entertaining something that is toxic for someone here you're allowing someone to use you i do see spirit is taking action to try and heal you from whatever this is um to protect your peace to protect your peace, somebody here is very tempting or going to be tempted by someone, okay? That's the energy that's coming around you. And your spirit guides are feeling the need to be there to protect you. And I'm getting a strong energy of protecting you from yourself because you've either outgrown this situation or you're too good for whatever situation this is. Spirit is feeling that you are deserving of something more. Show me spirit. Show me protection. Show me protection for Virgo. We got two. From nastiness, hasteness. Some type of argument. Protecting you from somebody that doesn't mean you well. When life gives you lemons, make lemonade. Look at that. It says make lemonade. Opportunity. You're being protected because you're, you're on the verge of something else. You're on the verge of persevering some type of situation you're on the verge of overcoming a situation overcoming a some type of position that you put yourself into in life it's some type of limiting it's like a limiting authority a limiting belief something that limited you something that restricted you your spirit guides are stepping in to protect you from the energy for some of you guys you have some jealous individuals around you you have some jealous, argumentative individuals around you. You may be clashing with someone today. Give me a sec. You definitely may be clashing with someone today out of jealousy. Someone's jealous because you are you are you're being given an opportunity. Why you actually earned it? Whatever this opportunity is, is something that you earned. It's something because it's it's due to your talents due to your creativity towards your passion it's something that you it's like a gift that you have it's it's you're doing something that only you can do it the way that you do it is what i'm is what i'm seeing here and you're making you're making lemonade out of whatever situation you have yeah show me action i do like that for you guys it says god don't like ugly no he don't and that's why your spirit guides are stepping in to protect you from somebody here that does not mean well by you this is somebody that's very argumentative so you may clash with someone today but i see you doing okay fine like i see you persevering from it it's like mm, kind of unbothered is the energy that i'm giving then we have action it's blowing up esteem there's a sudden transformation. There's something that's happening in your life that's going to bring hope. That's going to give you hope. Something's about to happen and it's going to give you hope. It's going to happen 
all of a sudden, it is going to happen all of a sudden, but Spirit is saying that it is a necessary shakeup. It's to get you out of a funk, to get you out of a situation that you needed to be that you needed to be taken from. Because I do see that some of you guys are entertaining something that is toxic. You're entertaining something that is not meant to be. Some of you guys, you're entertaining a third party and whatever that is. Some of you guys, you're holding on to something that you should have let you should have let go some time back. I do see overindulgence. I see a lot of overindulgence. There's a group of you guys. I see a lot of overindulgence. I also see for a group of you guys, you are entertaining some type of third party something is what I'm seeing here. But I see your spirit guides are going to actually be stepping in. Something's going to happen and it's going to be a change that's going to happen significantly. It's going to change whatever is going on in that situation. Show me spirit. Show me these extremes. Chicken with his head cut off. Very busy. Overwhelming. You're dealing with something that... Mm, somebody here actually has an addiction. Somebody here is like giving me a very nervous energy. I see a lot of stress, a lot of chaos surrounding whatever this overindulgence is. Whatever this extreme is. Spirit is saying for you to refocus and redo. There's a need for you to refocus, to take your energy back from whatever this is, to step back, analyze yourself, analyze the situation before moving forward, okay? I do see that it's actually causing you some stress and some anxiety. It's causing you a lot of stress and anxiety. Show me spirit. For some of you guys, you're actually working way too much, way too much, and actually you're, you're becoming more stressful in working way too much you feel like you need to but it's actually not bringing peace into your life it's actually not bringing peace into your life show me peace there's more than one way to skin a cat that's the energy that i'm getting i feel like your spirit guides they want to assist you they want you to know that for some of you the way that you're doing things is not the way that your spirit guide suggests that you do it. It says soon there will be a breakthrough. Soon there will be a solution. It's all about your hope and your faith. Hmm. This is all about your, 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 your faith, but your peace, your peace of mind. Some of you guys, you may, you may have been struggling financially. I see that your spirit guides are actually stepping in and there's going to be a solution to your problem. Some type of breakthrough within your financial strain. I do see, I do see you guys blossoming, loving yourself, loving yourself. I do see some of you guys, your, your insecurities are kind of at its peak right now. Your spirit guides wants you to know that you have the power to manifest anything. You know what I've been reading lately? I've been reading up on the law of attraction. Um, and it's all about positive thoughts. Your positive thoughts bring positive things into your life. Your negative thoughts brings negative thoughts things into your life there's something that's very unexpected something that is very unexpected that's coming into your life and why I feel like it's an investment it's an investment in a person place thing or situation that's going to actually have a positive return for you is what I'm getting in this energy some of you guys are going to be meeting someone new but you're going to be resisting you're, you're you don't you're not trusting right now you're not trusting spirit is saying for you to be patient to be patient because for some of you guys you want something new you want something new mm -hmm. you just come to some type of realization and you're trying to come out of this dark place you're definitely trying to come out of this dark place but the thing about it is you've been resist you've been resisting for so long why because you've built up this resilience you've become so strong that you've uh, you've kind of become numb to the pain itself your spirit guys that's why they feel that you're that you need protection because you're taking certain actions that are not aligning with your blessings they're not aligning with your blessings bottom of the deck it says a little something i threw together look at that god has not threw a little something together for you it says accomplishment triumph your self-esteem knowing your self-worth your self-respect and your self-love confidence talent fame i told you for some of you guys there's something that's coming towards you why because only there's something in your life that only you can do it the way that you do it 
And there's some recognition that's coming from that. There's some recognition. There's mastering of a skill. There's definitely some, some of you guys will become famous. Some of you guys will become famous. Spirit is saying to keep the faith. Keep the faith and in, 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 it's like dream. Dream big. Keep hope in your life. Positive thoughts brings positive responses. I want you guys to think, move accordingly today. Positive thoughts bring positive back into your life. Show me spirit. Show me protection. The hangman, you're free. Your freedom. You you're free. You're free to make whatever choices you want in life. You're free from a situation. I feel like your spirit guides are going to free you from some type of situation. Something that's been holding you back and something that you have not been wanting to let go of. For some reason, you're holding on to it. I feel like due to fear. When I look over as all I see is fear. But it's affecting your peace, your peace of mind. Show me the hangman. Strength. You don't feel strong, strong Leo energy. You don't feel, see, that's that, that lack of self-confidence. That's that fear within some of you guys. You have a lack of self-confidence. You have fear. And that's why your spirit guides are having to step in because you're not taking the necessary actions. But there is going to be a sudden change that's going to happen into your life. A major transformation, major transformation. Show me spirit. Seven of Pentacles. It's going to take some hard work. It's going to take some hard work on your behalf. You're going to have to. Sorry about that, guys. Um, you're going to have to definitely push through. With the Seven of Pentacles here, it's definitely going to take a lot of hard work. A lot of hard work. Because this change is going to happen. And it's like getting the rug pulled from under you. But it's because it's because you, you didn't do what you were supposed to do. You didn't let go of something you didn't let go of some type of commitment that has been holding you back. A commitment with your career, a commitment with your family, a commitment within a relationship. You've been holding on to something that is no longer serving you and your spirit guides are going to have to step in. And that's for your protection. They gave you the chance. They gave you the chance. They gave you the opportunity. They gave you their free will. This is all about your free will. They gave it to you and you didn't take action. So your spirit guides are going to step in for you. And it's going to feel like they done pulled the rug from under you and yes you're going to have to put in a lot of work a lot of work you're making yourself have to work harder you're making yourself have to work harder due to the things that you're still holding on to that you no longer need to hold on to even if it's a pain even if it's a pain a sadness a sorrow spirit is saying that you need to forgive you won't forget but you definitely need to forgive. It's time. You've been losing sleep over something that was meant to be. You've been losing sleep over something that spirit put something into your life to teach you a lesson. And you've been holding on to that instead of learning the lesson and moving forward. Okay. Some of you guys, you're still, you're hard headed. Some of you guys, you're as hard headed as I don't even know. You're so hard headed and you're still doing the same things. You're still entertaining the same things that actually through your life spinning through this upheaval into your life that th it was like a ripple effect that's happening here some of you guys are still holding on to it and some of you guys you're on the other side of it where spirit brought that change into your life and now you're having to face it and it's not it hasn't been easy why because you didn't pay attention to all the red flags you weren't paying attention to all the red flags that spirit kept throwing at you so spirit had to step in show me spirit Ten of Cups. This is so you can have your happiness. I do see for a group of you guys, you're you're still holding on to some pain, some sadness, some sadness and some pain. Spirit is bringing this. Spirit is bringing this forward. Why? To give you hope. To give you hope for a brighter future. Four of Cups. But because you, you're kind of over it, you've lost faith. You have lost faith and you're kind of over it. You're all in your head stressing over this. All in your head. It's like a, a, a never-ending thought. With the two of pentacles, you're juggling a lot with the ten of pentacles. Because this is, see, you're all about your finances. 
you're working i feel like you're having to work so much harder you feel like you're having to work so much harder for the money the stability your foundation you have the ten of cups and the ten of pentacles that's that's a major that's some major accomplishments. That's some major things that's happening for you. But it's on the other side of you letting go of something that you're still holding on to. There's something that you do, Spirit is calling you to refocus on something. Definitely to refocus on something. You're juggling a lot to get to your Ten of Pentacles. I get that. See, that's that energy where I was getting. Some of you guys, you're working way too hard. You're way, you're working way too hard and things are not coming to you the way that it, they're supposed to be coming towards you. You feel some type of blockage. You feel some type of blockage, but I feel like it's because if that's that law of attraction. You're still thinking negative. You're not appreciating the little thing. You're not showing gratification for the little things that you have. It's like you're working, you're working, but you're sour, like you're sour about it. This is by choice. This is by choice. I feel like spirit is tell, trying to tell you that you're going to always have enough. You're going to always have enough. Somebody is, is, is reluctant on making a decision with judgment that flew out in the, that flew out in the reverse. Somebody is very reluctant on making a decision, but it's a major decision. It's a major decision that needs to be made. It absolutely needs to be made. And somebody's scared to make that decision. But it's starting to mess with your peace, your peace of mind. Show me. The Hierophant, the Hermit, I'm sorry. Virgo Energy. This is all about you seeking wisdom. This is the wisdom that the spirit guides are giving to you to bring your peace of mind. Some of you guys, there is snakes in your in your area, meaning they could literally be snakes in your area. But people, there's people in your life that does not mean you well. They don't mean you well. These people are some people that you've already walked away from. You know this. But for some of you guys, I'm hearing these are some family members. I'm hearing these are some family members. Show me. Show me the hermit. But this is you. You're reluctant on making a decision, which with the chariot that came out in the reverse, it's blocking you. These breakthroughs, because look at that. We have breakthrough with the chariot that flew out in the reverse. There is obstacles and there's blockages here and you feel it. You feel it. But you know why that is? It's because you're still entertaining things that is no longer meant for you. You're still doing things that your spirit guides are watching and they're saying, no, you should not be doing this. So you're, you're blocking your own blessings. You're dealing with, you're dealing with people, places, and things that are not spiritually aligned with where you're trying to go, where your spirit guides are trying to get you. You keep saying it, you keep saying it, and you keep wanting it, but it's all about your positive thoughts that will bring positive things into your life it's all about your positive actions that's going to bring positive things into your life i feel like for some of you guys you may want it and you could want it all you want but it is according to what actions you're taking as well okay show me spirit what does your heart want wow that card came out yesterday what does your heart want I feel like spirit is calling that forward for you guys for a reason, for a reason. Spirit wants you to think about it. What do you want? What do you really, 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 really want? I feel like some of you guys, you're not even sure. You're not even sure what it is that you want. You're so lost. I'm getting such a lost energy. You're, you have fear. You have a lot of fear. A lot of fear. Time to move on. Flow with the river. See where it takes you, y'all. Look at that. It is time to move on. This is what this is all about. See, it's step, take a step. Take a, a leap of faith. Step out on faith. There's something here. Spirit is calling you. Calling you to take a leap of faith. Spirit is screaming. It is time for you to move on from something that you're overindulging in, something that you're entertaining that you should no longer be entertaining, that you take two steps forward and three steps backwards every time you revisit something that you need not, that you need not. And this is all due to fear. 
This is all due to fear, but it's affecting your peace. It is affecting your peace of mind. It really and truly is. All right, my loves. Bottom of the deck, we have you are bright energy. Spirit wants you to think about that. This is why I will leave you guys. I hope you have an absolutely, absolutely positively wonderful day. And I love you all. Bye, guys.